Hi everybody. Today we're going to do the sun, I think it's a sunset instead of a sunrise a tropical painting because I think this is the moon. So the sun setting, because I can't be the sun because it would be giving off. So I think I said it wrong. I think it's a sunset. So, um, you know how you can see the moon and the sunset at a certain sky. So we're going to, we're going to paint the background first. Then put clouds. Clouds are harder than they look because it's the texture, shape, and color that makes it look like a cloud. And some people want to go side to side making clouds, but that's the wrong texture, right? It'd be stripedy clouds, but these are made out of little circles, right? And that's how you get the floof. So we're going to do the background, that, then water, then, then palm trees. Okay, and then this is the uh, other one that I did a little purple in the sky up here we'll see how high up so at last this time we got so high we're already in pink and we didn't have room for purple so we'll see okay so it's about a, a hand big oh and, a, and, the, and the pencil goes on the bottom right if you can see mine it lines up with the top of the water right so that sky water like that and we're gonna it's about a hand is yellow a hand is baby orange, like orange and yellow mixed together. And then a hand is orange, then a hand is pink. And if we have room, we put purple too. So it's, so it goes dark, lighter, 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 like that. Okay. And then this painting, we love it because of the, um, the color wheel. So the sky is, uh, purple to yellow, right? And then the water goes this way. So it's both sides of the color wheel. So if we, if we mix too much, we basically just get an orange color. Boring. And if we mix too much on this side, we basically just get a blue. I'm like, no, we want to see different versions of the color. So we're more gentle than you normally would be, right? So when you, you're like, stop, you keep mixing it. It's going to disappear. And I will try to coach you on that part of stop painting, right? That's the hardest part. Instead of decorating, decorating, and all of a sudden it changes. Okay, so we're going to use, we're going to make our sky with our biggest paintbrush. And we hold it like a, like a pencil, like that. Because I want to be able to use the smooth flat side, right? This is pokety like that so I use the flat and smooth and then and I push and pull my paint with the flat side and it's smoother that way and I'm gonna switch back the gallery view for me so it's smooth like that and then we get it wet with white who's done this with me before using white and then decorating in the wet white and moving the paint around so we're going to get it wet with white and then decorate it and then get it wet with white again and then decorate it again that's why there are these pastel -y colors because they mix with white because look at look at pink yeah right how did it turn this mix it with white right or this super dark orange, you're like, mm, that's really great. But then I got like a baby orange because I mixed it with white. Okay, so can you find your three uh, sky colors? This side of the color wheel, the yellow, orange, pink. And of course, our white and open all those. Open the white. Look how much white we have. So we don't have to be afraid to run out. And then how does it go? Red, orange, yellow, green, purple. So I'm going to put them in order. Get out of my way, lids. There. Awesome. Big paintbrush. Did you open them? Yeah. Mostly so we're on your mark, get set, go. So we ha I have my white open, then my yellow open, my orange open, and my pink, and we'll see about purple. Okay. Oh, and if you have sleeves, you push up your sleeves because... Your arms go in the paint for no reason. I don't know how. They just do. Do I have any paint? Oh, I do have paint on me already. I don't know how it is. I know. Okay, so we're going to get our, our white paint. And we're going to uh, fill up this uh, about half from the water to about halfway. 
it's, not, it's a guess, right? But it's like this, it's like the yellow is a hand and the baby orange is a hand. So I don't know, halfway, right? So I'm gonna go, all right, so let's just stab our white paint like we're a man. And I just go, stab! And I got some white paint like that. <laughs> and we'll just put a mark where we want the white paint because we're, we're gonna go above that, of course, but this paint dries so fast that if we get the whole thing wet with white, the top would be dry already, especially in the summer, right? So I'm just gonna go, I don't know, so about as big as a giant open hand or the halfway mark between the water and the top of the painting. And you just go, I don't know, there, and put a mark for your brain. Just to say, okay, that is where my white, I'm just gonna stay below that. Click, your very first mark on the painting. Then stretch it across so it's a line. Push it off the page and pull it off the page. Now I just have a line. And the only reason you can see mine is because it's shiny, right? That's true with white paint. We're putting white paint on a white background. The only way you'll be able to tell if you painted it is if it's white. Shiny, I mean, if it's shiny. So you're like, I don't, is it shiny? Let me, because that's the only way you'll be able to tell. Okay, now let's get it sopping wet with white from that line down to the water line. And you can get paint on this thing, on the pencil. It won't hurt nothing because the water goes on top of the sky. So now I'm going to stab my white really hard like I'm mad. <laughs> I got a lot. But once I get a bunch on my paintbrush, I just push and pull it around and move it around, move, move, move it around, right? And we want to go only side to side, though. We don't, even though you could go up and down, we're trying to keep the texture side to side because that's the way the wind blows. Push and pull. So we're just going to get it sopping wet with white paint and I just go smush, smash. Okay. And then two swipes i'm already out of paint i'm gonna get more stab my paint really hard Ooh, okay disgusting amount and then go below that okay and then still not enough paint so we stab our paint again smash and using the flat side of the paintbrush right and go all the way down to the water smush man there And then, look at, can you kind of see my painting? I don't know. Look at the parts that are dry. What? I see this. Oh, I gotta go hunting. Okay. So, the side, I didn't, I missed that. Okay. And I missed that over there. Okay. Oh, near the bottom. Miss that. Okay. What if I have blobs of white paint? It's just gonna be shiny parts of your sky. I know him. And then look, look for shininess. Make sure, oh, see, I just went to the side and I can see I'm at, uh, right there. I can see the shininess in the, from the sun. I mean, from the light in the room. Okay, now let's, let's stab our white. We're gonna put globs of little, little puddles of white paint. And then when we accidentally hit them with our paintbrush, They'll look like clouds, like a little white streak, a little something. Okay, so I'm just gonna stab my white stab, and just it's like a booker, a little blob, a blob, and I just go, okay, um, blob, and then uh, a blob, and a uh, blob. Okay, there, just a like a big goober of white and a goober, and it just so that they it will be extra bright right there. When our yellow paint hits that, it'll be shinier. Okay, now who remembers how to do a blend or a fade, right? We're gonna put yellow at the top and make a dark yellow. How many color values for 3D? At least three. Dark, medium, light. So our first yellow will be a whole paintbrush big of dark yellow. But then what's left on our paintbrush will go down a little bit and it'll be lighter. And then I go down a little bit even lighter because I start to run out of paint on purpose out of my paintbrush, on purpose. So it's very yellow, not very yellow, running out of yellow, white. 
Okay, so let's find our yellow and give her a nice hard stab. There's probably going to be yellow left, but now I just go, Ooh. okay. And it's just one paintbrush big of some yellow, right? It's just, you just drop on the white paint because we need white to help us, you know, and, and I just wipe it off on the top of the white paint, like that. Just wipe it off. And we don't clean our paintbrush. I would have told you we need the white paint in our paintbrush to make this new color. Blob the white, the yellow paint. And I put it on the top of the white paint because I'm going to make baby yellow. Now let's get another stab of it. Stab! And do it again. But look at how it's so dark on this side. But this side has less. I'm going to start on this side so she could be dark too. Alright. Alright. Because you know where you get paint and you land, it's super dark. And then by the time you go over there, it runs out. Okay, now let's smash it in and make a new baby yellow color. It still stays one paintbrush big, but I go smush, smash, and I fall off the page. Smush, smash, and I'm using the flat side of my paintbrush. The tip of my paintbrush, if I hold it like a, a pencil, it'll scratch my paint. So I flatten it and go smush, smush, crush it in. Oh, look at it change. See? Why use a napkin? Get it off quick. Now you have an official uh, shirt for painting. And, and crush it in. Smash it hard. Smash it in. Shoosh. Okay. Now, okay, look what colors in our paintbrush. A baby yellow. So let's go on um, like halfway and wipe off this yellow another row lower. Just what's in our paintbrush. Smash, smash. Oh, it's a baby yellow. Look at, and it is touching the bottom of that yellow. I just went whoop, whoop. I don't go back up to the top, right? But I just, oh, it's pretty. And I give it permission to be lighter because there's only a little bit of yellow left in my paintbrush. So I go a row lower. And they do touch, they overlap. Okay, now I'm, what's left in your paintbrush now? Even babier yellow. Can you go lower again? Smush, smush. Oh, it's even babier. And what if it's acting dry? Who thinks theirs is acting dry? Can you just get a stab of white paint? There you go. And smush it in. If it acts all dry, get more white paint until it to, you know, be softer. Okay, what's left now? The most invisiblest baby yellow for all the way down to the water. Oh, nice. And then so it's darkest, and I never go back up to the top and get more yellow. I am trying to run out of yellow. It's very yellow at the top. I'm running out of yellow and it's light yellow. Then I'm almost out of yellow when I get to the bottom and then invisible. And I give it permission to do that. I don't need to go back and fixy fixy. I like that it goes dark, medium-ish, lighter, lighter, lighter. Who's ready to make a new color? That was fun, right? Who has a hair? If you get a hair, these come apart. So if you get a hair, you use the bristles like this and you come underneath the hair. I don't have one, but I'm faking. And you go scratch. And the little hairs capture, the, capture it and you go, get off there. Your fingers are too big. You can't get it with your fingers. Okay. Now I'm going to get orange, but I want to make baby orange. So we can, we'll make it darker orange higher up, right? But I would like to make it baby orange. So I need just some. So look how much pigment is in this gel. A lot. So I'm just going to poke it some. So I just touch it a little bit and I got some. See how that's way less than when we did yellow. It's just some. some orange right and I never clean my paintbrush yet because we need the moisture that's in this paintbrush to help us make new colors okay now it's right on top of the yellow we already made let's make baby yellowy orange right here but I'm gonna turn my paintbrush the flat skinny way like this you know so I can just wipe it off and go Meh. 
Now let's mush it in. Who feel like you didn't get enough? Do you want to poke again? Because there's no way to know how much. You're like, did I get enough? Do I need another poke? You decide. Okay, now let's smash it in and make baby orange. Smush, smash, smush, smash, smushy, smashy, smushy, smashy. I just fall off the page and fall off the page and fall off the page and fall off the page. And I made a baby color. But I keep going squishy, squishy. Like that. Oh, look at it. But you, and smash it in the nice big way. And look what's in my paintbrush now. This yummy baby orange. Well, right now it looks like this. Look at my look at look at me. Everybody pause. I have baby orange and yellow, and it makes like a line, like a flag. Ugh. No, we have to let it fade and disappear into our yellow. So just use this baby baby orange and go one row lower, and it will be very misty and invisible. Oh, it's so misty. Oh, it's nice and invisible, like that. Oh, I just wiped off what was left in my paintbrush a little lower, and I made an invisibly color. Nice. So it's baby orange, then misty, almost invisible. And I gave it permission to do that, and I used the big paintbrush, so I dropped off. This was baby, baby orange. And then the misty orange was like one paintbrush below that. Smushy, smashy. And it becomes like a, so oh, it just disappears inside your yellow. But remember, don't let the very bottom be a perfectly straight line. Everybody pause and look. I do not want it perfectly straight, so maybe no straight lines. Goodbye. It's a sky, not a flag. Okay. Oh, look at my straight line neck where my, my, that's perfectly straight. Look it. I don't like it. Let me ruin it just a little. Okay. Th there, there. I'm still straight going like this, but uh, let me just tell that perfectly straight line to calm down. Okay. There. I looked a little harsh, a little hard, a little perfect. Okay. Now we get to make orange. Okay, so dirty paintbrush, don't care. We're gonna get white and do a little, um, go from halfway between this orange line and the top, I don't know, make, paint it white. But what if this white paint gets on my baby orange? So, it'll just make soft orange, we don't care. So I stab my white, stab with my dirty paintbrush because these are gonna make new colors. Stab! And I'm just gonna go, I don't know, halfway, like right in the middle finger area. And I just go, whoop, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> and then smash it in, Leave. Oh, look at that pretty color. Cause it's in my paintbrush already. <gasps> so pretty, so pretty. And then is it sopping wet with white paint? Cause we decorate the white, right? Okay, orange, but maybe a little more orange than we used last time. That was just making baby orange on yellow. Now we can actually make orange, okay? So I see how much pigment she has. So maybe not a hard stab, but I'm definitely gonna put my paintbrush all the way in there. But see how it's all the way across this time? The other one was just like a little bit, but now I'm, okay. But I don't go like that. That would be way too much. And then hold it, hold it like a skinny little paint, skinny, just to drop it off. We'll mush it in. I'm gonna put it on that wet paint I just made and just go, ew, get off my paintbrush. Okay, there. See, it came off. And then decorate, smash it in, make orange. Oh. So pretty, so pretty, so pretty. Orange. Nice. But look what I did. I don't like this. Look at what I did right there. Look at, I didn't let the orange and the baby orange touch. I better let some of this orange go on my baby orange. Everybody pause and look up. Look at what I have. Orange, big, no. I gotta make this area where they touch fuzzier. So I'm just gonna go and go. 
you calm down where you two meet. I put a little bit of the, the orange on my baby orange and the orange on my baby orange there. You calm down. All right. I can see it now. Oh, there's one of the hairs. I'll show you how to get it off. I got one. And I, you can, I don't know if you could barely see that. But I just go. And the, ha the hairs from this paintbrush grabbed it. And I can get it off. Okay, and that can fix it. Okay. Go put it on. Oh, there's another one. What the heck? Get off. And then I get it off. Okay. All right. Now it's dirty paintbrush. Let's put white on it. And the next row, white and, and pink. But my paintbrush is dirty. Orangey pink is gorgeous. So I stab my white. And I can go all the way off the top of the painting. And just go, okay, get it wet. And it's basically light orange. We're going to add pink. And is it a sky or is it a flag? It's a sky. So your edges don't have to be like perfectly straight. They could be la 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 la. But you still have to go side to side because of wind. Yeah. New color. Smash it in. Make a new color. Okay. And then, is it all sopping wet at the top with white? Because now I get to add pink. Okay, let's see. And do not be scared of this pink, okay? This company only puts a little teeny bit of powder in their gel. So you think it looks dark until you put it on your camera. It's like, where did my pink go? So we're gonna get all this pink and just go, oh, oh like that. So it can be pink, like that. Scoop it, a little disgusting amount. And then we'll put it, wipe it off on the tip top of your painting. And we'll sneak it down. Did you use pink or purple, Julia? Why does yours look like purple? I used pink. Oh, okay. It just looks purple in the, uh, in the reflection. Okay. I think mine has purple in it, that's why. Okay, now I'm gonna stay close to the ceiling towards the top, right, tip, 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 top, and smash it in. Shmoosh, look at how light it turns once you mix it with the white. Dang, right? You're like, I thought it was super dark pink until you put it with the white, and you're like, where did my pink go? So it's a lot of pink. You're like, pink? You need to be a lot of pink. Because you are delicate. Delicate. But look, where my pink touches my orange is boring. I I need to let some of my look at it's a flag again. They're just touching. Does that look like a sky? No. Can we get some of the pink just left in my pretty paintbrush and put it in the orange? It'll make a new color. You wanna see? Okay, so I already did the tip top is pretty, right? But now I'm gonna go a little bit lower and put some of this pink in my orange. Oh, look at, I made pink, not all the way down, just pinky orange happen. It's so pretty. I let the pink and the orange mix right there. They touched and they overlapped and they made something new. And I made pinky orange. Did you do it? Do you love it? You know what I wish? I wish it was a little teeny bit darker at the top. Can we get some purple? But with our purple, we have to use our finger because there's so little in here that this giant paintbrush will just won't, won't work. I'm telling you, okay? So just get your finger of purple and get a scoop. A scoop. A scoop of purple because it's just a little bit and we mostly just need this purple to put in the clouds so they look shadowy and I'm just gonna wipe it across the tippity tippity top get off my finger yeah there <laughs> oh and then I can wipe off my finger on a napkin Yeah. Okay, 
like black. Okay, now can we mush that in a cut there and make like a darker pink? Maybe, maybe hold our paintbrush the skinny way so it'll just be smaller, right? So it'll be a little smaller purple. So you just go. So it's a small piece of purpley pink. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm making the paint paint in my paintbrush this color. I as I smash it into my painting, I'm actually making a color in my paintbrush. See? Now you do it. Julie, did you freeze? And now turn your paintbrush big. Flip. And now go and make and let a little bit of this purple end up in your pink. And I switch to the big, you know, going big. And I just go, all right, I just drop off a little bit of purple and my pink, and that's all. <gasps> so good, right? But I went from little, and I made the color of my paintbrush be little. Then I, like that, then I switched to big. And that dropped off some purple in my pink, but I'm a little bit ratty about it, you know, not perfect, cause not a flag. Those straight lines don't really need to be in a sky. So I'm just like, mm -hmm. all righty, fabulous. Who loves it? How come? Let's look at it. We have yellow in it. We have yellow orange in it. We have orange in it. We know we have orangey pink. We skipped over red and we used pink, right? Pink, orangey pink, and then purple. Boom! A whole half of a color wheel. Awesome! Love, 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 love. And then we could just set this. I got blurry. Am I blurry to you? Oh, it came back. And then this big paintbrush, we'll just let it rest. We don't have to clean it because the extra moisture in there will keep it from getting stiff. So we'll just leave it like that and just put it on your tablecloth. The tablecloth can handle it, right? And just let it rest like that. Oh, let me get this. You're still decorating, still figuring it out, still playing with it, right? But I want to show you on the color wheel too. I remember this. If you use, if you let two things on the opposite set of the color wheel, it will turn brown. If I mixed yellow and purple, that's brown. If I mix red and green, that's brown. Red and green that way. Oh, blue and orange, brown. You ever play with Play-Doh and it looked like a cat turd and you didn't want to play with it anymore? It's because you thought those two colors opposite each other are so pretty. It's called contrast, high contrast. Then you mix them together and you went, Ugh. and then just like, what did it just make? But we have purple up here and we have yellow down here. How come we didn't make brown? Because every time we climbed up, we were going that color next to that color. And each none of the colors were hurting each other. So by the time we got to purple, there was no yellow in our paintbrush. And we didn't have to use any water. Good job. Okay, now we're going to make clouds. You guys ready? Ready to go to make clouds? And this is wet, so I'm gonna put this down here because I'm gonna show you clouds. Who's painted clouds with me before? Remember your paintbrush is dirty and you with yellow with purple in it, so you can't go down to where yellow is or you'll make brown. We're just going a little bit, little bit, and then we stop, right? We can't let colors on the opposite end of the color wheel mix. So we're just going tiny piece, tiny piece, another tiny piece. But look what we're going to do to our background anyway. If you have a part you hate, what are we about to do? Put clouds on it. So anything that you hate, we put clouds on it. And the clouds, you think they're big, they're not. 
going like three fingers at their biggest, two fingers at their smallest, right? They're not very big. So most of the sky lives, and we just need a little bit of cloud. And then, Wait, um, Miss Pixie? Uh-huh. Wait, do we have to color the background all black? Oh, like this? No, this is my demonstration board to show you white clouds, and I can't do it on white or you wouldn't be able to see it. So I'm going to demonstrate this black right now. We're making this, but I just want to show you the size of the cloud. It's, you know, three fingers, two fingers, it's little, so there should be plenty of sky left, right? You guys need to stop playing with your background with your dirty paintbrush. Your dirty paintbrush has pink and purple in it, and you're dropping it off inside the yellow, which is making brown. We only did the tippy top, and then we stopped, and then we were doing something else. Okay, so now I'm going to do um, our, our cloud demonstration. So this paintbrush just rests on your tablecloth. Okay, so everybody stop what you're doing and watch what I'm doing. You ready? Okay, so now I'm gonna use this uh, this round paintbrush. Janae, I see people painting in your room and we should be done with the background. You're just adding color and it's just gonna make brown. So please stop and start making clouds. J Janae's I room? I think they were a little behind. You guys need to stop what you're doing and be finished because you have to watch me make clouds. Janae's room, can you hear me? Okay, I need to see all three of your eyes to make sure you're seeing me make clouds. You guys ready? Okay, so clouds are a shape, color, and texture, right? Clouds have flat bottoms, right? And here's where I just put a stripe. It didn't go back and fit. It's still flat, even though it has some fluffs on the bottom. But we make them out of tiny, tiny circles, like this. So is there anyone who is painting still? No painting? We're watching me make uh, clouds, okay? So we go, everybody hold up your paintbrush so I can see, and go little, 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 as tiny and little round circles as you can make. Tiny, 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 little tiny, oh, 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 no, maybe zero, 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 like that, okay? So the texture to make clouds is, what? Round and round and round and round and round, is it like this? No, that's a stripe, right? And then, well, this is my engine. And then, while it's spinning, now I go up. Andrea, are you there? I don't see Andrea. Okay, you need to watch me make these clouds. You cannot look away. Tell your friend to look, please. Okay, so I go. And then, now I can go up, down, up, down, up. Remember when you were little and you made clouds like this? Humpty, 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 Humpty made out of M's? No, they're flat bottom made out of poofs and the poofs are made out of little circles, okay? So, and then we add a little bit of shadow with a little bit of color, but we never let the color touch the top. It always stays pure white, okay? So we're gonna do it together. And so your brain has to be frustrated and confused first, then you understand it, and then it's easy. So the first one we'll make small because it's gonna be very ugly because it's your first one. Then you'll understand it and then we'll make them easy, okay? So I just wanna, let me show you on the black. So I'm gonna get some white and I go stab. Like that and I just stab my paint like, watch me do it, don't look away. Who's looking away? Watch me do it and I go straight line. It's not gonna stay straight. But I turn on my engine, run and 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 Oh, because it's fluffy. And then as I'm spinning, kind of like a vacuum cleaner spins while you push it around, then I push it up. And then I let it fall. Okay, that's one puff. My next puff cannot be the same size. So maybe a baby one. Oh. And then my next one will be super humongous. Okay, and then itty bitty baby one, I don't know.
But what happens to the ends? They're always tiny and pointy. So I get a, a little bit, and I just go, wee, 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 Okay, so that is the texture and the shape of a cloud. Now I have to add color. So for us, we're gonna use purple, and I'm gonna use uh, my little square paintbrush to drop off my purple because this will get way too much paint, right? So I just get a little bit of purple, and I just wipe it off on the floor of my of my cloud, and I just go, get off my paintbrush, Ugh. there, right? But I rub it in, and it's just for her tummy, the floor, and the tummy. So everybody watch. Watch me do it. Here I go. Here I go. I start spinning. Oh, fluff. And then I go higher, higher. I'm running out. I'm running out. Stop. I almost touched the top. And then I go. I'm running. Don't touch the top. And then I go. So scared to touch it. And then I'm like, run. Okay, now it's purple. She's a purple tummy. Okay, so you want to do it together? I'm going to clean my paintbrush because I got purple in it. So you ready? So where does it go at? Let's look at this one. Hmm. Let's do this itty bitty baby one. And she's like the hand from the top, like where my thumb is. So I'm like, oh, is it like a right? So I just go, hmm, hmm, wait. All right, uh, how does that be? Oh, okay, so I stab my white, stab! Remember, you get close to your painting, you get comfortable, right? And I'm just gonna, I don't know, a hand, so I just go and swipe, okay. It's near the side. But does that look like a cloud? No. So we have to turn on the engine to make teeny tiny circles. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Wipe off the white first. Straight line, whatever. Way up here near purple. Right? Straight. And then I turn on the engine. Tiny, 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 tiny. Okay. Because this is my texture. Here I go. Watch me. And I'm going to start spinning. I'm going to make one little bump. I'm making my fluff. I'm making my fluff. And now I go up, 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 up. Oh, I made a bump. Yeah. Oh, wait. Let's put one next to that. So now I just turn on the engine. Maybe bigger, 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 bigger. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Now let's put one next to that. Oh, oh, that one was funny. Next to that. And then what happens to the ends? Oh, the, right near the floor of the cloud, I put itty bitty pointy pointy baby and itty bitty pointy baby. The pointy, look, look, I'm using the very, I, I sneak up and try to use the flat edge of my paint. Look at, I'm holding it kind of flat. I'm trying to use just one hair. Not, I don't go straight ahead, that's too big. So I'm going, one hair did it. Okay. I know, the kid's pointy. Okay. Well, is that 3D? No, it's just white. It's so boring. I can't. But does it have shape and texture? And then does each one of your bumps a different size? No matchy matchies. It's not M's. That's when babies make clouds. M, 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 M. I just want to make sure they're all different. Okay. Now I'll put some color. Can you find your little square paintbrush? Wait, wait, stop, Annalyn. We're just going to put, let's decorate this one. She's only white. Let's put a little shadow in her. So I find your little blue paintbrush. Switch paintbrushes. Little blue paintbrush. Did you find it? And find your purple. And I'm just going to put it on the, I get a little scoop. A little bit. And I'm going to drop it off. Annalyn, you got to change paintbrushes. <coughs> And I get purple. And I'm just going to wipe it off on the floor. On the cloud, but on the floor of the cloud. Ew. Bloop. Did you do it? Put a little... Because that will be 3D. But do I ever, ever let the top... It's purple, not blue. 
And and do I ever let this purple touch the top of my cloud? Never. Have to stop. Okay. So let's turn on the engine. Now switch to this uh, cloud making paintbrush. Switch paintbrushes back to the floofer. This is the floofer one. Floof. And this is just for texture. I would just like to make a fluffy shadow. So I'm gonna go, okay, here I go. I'm gonna start spinning. Wait, now I have to go up, but I have to go slow because I don't want it to touch the top. So I go, okay. And then I touch it the next row and I go, it's running out, it's all okay. That's okay, I don't care. I just don't want it to touch the top. And then I get it again. And then I could do this one, and then, and, then, and then I'm done. I just floofed it in. And then I'm just gonna put a little bit in the corners because they're jealous. So that's your most ugly cloud. And look at, I have a piece of super dark purple still left. Is that bad? No? Wait, switch to the fluffy paintbrush now, Annalyn. Now turn it into fluff. Fluff, 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 fluff. But never touch, never touch the bot, the top with the, you, you just go, start circles, circles, circle, 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 yeah, yeah, and then you pause. And you just give it different versions of purple, okay. Okay, let's do another one. That's my ugliest one. And does it have pointy, pointy ends? Okay. Now, ew, there's purple in my paintbrush and I wanna make a white cloud. Ah, what am I gonna do? No, we just get a paper towel. It won't hurt nothing. Just clean your paper towel like this. Look at Emmelyn. Look. <gasps> Squeeze. Okay. And then uh, it comes out. Clean your paintbrush. So we're going to make a white cloud. Look at me, Emmelyn. Emmelyn. Look. I get a paper towel and I put it inside and I fold it over and I squeeze the towel like that. Yeah, see, more paint comes out. Do it one more time just to get the extra little powder out. Squeeze! Okay, now I'm gonna get white. Okay, let's do another one. But this one's bigger. Because that little one was our practice. Now I'm gonna stab my white. Stab! And I get a big glob of white. Now I just go next to that one, right? And they have flat bottoms. So I make it nice and straight. And I just go. I, I don't know, um, there? Yeah, that's it. And it's just not, it's just, there's her friend, and there's a little space, and then a best friend. Hello. But it's not staying that way. It needs some floof. So you have to make it out of ton of, ton of, ton of circles. And who's ready to do it with me? You ready? Okay, now I'm gonna start spinning. How many sizes? I'm gonna go like five different sizes of puffs. You ready? Start spinning, here I go. I'm gonna try. So I turn, start the engine, little circles, little circles, little circles, oh, there's my fluff. And I go up, okay, a baby one. And then a medium sized one, oh. And then a baby one. No, a medium, I don't know. And then humongous giant one. And then, itty bitty baby. I don't know. I'm just trying to make sure that each one is a different size. Big, little, small, big, 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 little, small, big, big. And then, what always happens to the ends? Oh, tiny, itty bitty, little pointy things. That makes sense, right? Now we need to, is that, is that a 3D cloud? No, it's just white. So can we add a little shadow so we have dark, medium, and light? So um, where's my little blue blue paintbrush? Because I would like to drop off purple again. So I get a little bit of purple. Whoop. I just drop it off on the floor of this cloud. Ew, boogie. Okay. So I'm not going to leave it like that. Right. I put purple on it. 
Yeah, just like I was little sit. And then after, just wipe. No, wait, we did that one. We did do the next one, the brand, the one we just did, the brand new one. Yeah, just for the floor. And then switch to fluffy paintbrush. Fluffy. So I can make floof out of it. And then it's just for the tummy. And do we let this? It's just, nope, wait, you just got paint on it. Clean your paintbrush. It's too much blue. Clean your paintbrush. Okay, now with my, my white on my paintbrush, I just go, ooh, fluff, 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 fluff. Fluff, 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 just for the tummy. Just for the tummy parts. Fluff, 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 fluff. Fluff, 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 fluff. Fluff, 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 fluff. There. That's all he gets. A little bit for the tummy. Made out of floofs. The little, to those fluffy, fluffy circles, 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 circles. Now, Annalyn, make little circles. You already put your color. You need your, you need your fluffy paintbrush, but with no paint on it. Because you already put paint in your cloud, right? Now you just have to change her texture. Annalyn, look. Now just go and touch it. Look. Fluff it. Fluff the color in. Go and fluff the... You put color on your cloud. Fluff it in. Fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. Just for her tummy. Okay, now let's make another one. And it's down here in orange. Who's ready? I'm going to stab my white and make it really long. But it's like, eh, three fingers below those clouds, right? And I just wipe it off really long. Hello. It's a big, giant, long one. Oh, and I put it in the orange. Now it's just white, Annalyn. Look, white. I just told myself where it's going to live. Just get white. And now, what do I do? You did two really successfully. So now we make a big long one. How many fluffs can you make out of this one? I don't know. Watch. Okay. Start the fluffing. Circle, 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 circle. Okay. Circle, 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 circle. Fluff, 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 fluff. Okay. Then my next one. Little, little. Then big, 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 big. Then, oh, look at that's too round. I'm going to put some ugliness to it. So there, break it up a little. And then another one, medium. Okay. And then a BB. Then a big one. And then a me medium, me medium, and a ton. And then they have tiny little corners. Oh, look at the bottoms. Too perfect. I'm going to put some floofs on the bottom. There. It's too straight. Big little small little big little small little big little small little hoop fluff hop fluffy fluffy fluff 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 then a big fluff and a small fluff and a medium sized fluff and a big fluff and a small one. No side to side. It's made out of circles. Circle circle clouds are circles. Yes, texture matters. Okay, now let's decorate it. How about if we put a little bit of purple and a little bit of pink? Oh, I know. So I'm gonna get get my little blue paintbrush because she's little and she drops off less paint, right? So I get purple and I'm gonna put it on the floor, maybe there and there. And a bush and a bush. Fleek. And then I clean my paintbrush because I'm gonna go get pink. Just a little dash. A dash of purple and a dash of purple. And then I get pink. And now I'm going to put it, oh, pink. And then uh, there's purple there, so maybe pink in the middle. Hello. So it goes purple, space, purple. And then clean your paintbrush so you can get pink. So there could be a pink part. Okay, now where's my fluffy paintbrush? Now I'm gonna fluff. Ready? So I start at the bottom and I'm just gonna travel and I just go, okay, now I'm gonna fluff and I start spinning and I go up, 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 stop. And then up, 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 stop. Up, 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 stop. Up, 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 stop. I'm about to hit pink. I can't wait. Oh, pink. Oh, the pink one. Oh, the pink one. Oh, pink, 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 then a purple one. 
And then purple and pink. Purple, purple, pink, pink, purple, purple, pink. Fun. I think mine's too dark. Who thinks theirs are too dark? I'm going to clean my paintbrush and put a little white on it and tell it to calm down. I'm going to clean my paintbrush. I'm going to get a little bit of white. Watch me. Every pause and look up. Clean your paintbrush, Annalyn. Clean your paintbrush. Watch, because now it's too dark, right? Put some white back on the top. Fluff, 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 fluff. Fluff, 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 fluff. Oh, the top wants some more white. Put the top. White, white parts. White, white parts. White, white, white parts on the top, top, top. Little white parts for the fluff. Little white parts. The top, remember the tops of the clouds are always white? Put a little extra white fluff on the top. Just tell it to foof, foof, foof. The little round circle fluffs. Get white paint. You can wash out your paintbrushes so you can go back to pure white if you have too much color in your paintbrush. Okay, now we're gonna make the moon. Look at my moon. It goes right there between those two clouds. And it's nice and big, like three fingers big. Okay, now get what Annalyn, get some, clean your paintbrush. You can even wash it so you can get white paint and put white back on the tops of your cloud. The tops of your clouds are white. Okay, now we're going to make our moon. But to make our moon, we actually use our finger because it's nice and round. Yeah, that'll work, Annalyn. Just go and touch Touch the tip top of the cloud, the tip top of the cloud, the tip top of the cloud, just the tips. Poof, poof, poof. Yep. Poof, 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 for the tops, tops, tops. Smush, smush, smush. You can smush it in a little bit. It'll change colors. It'll mix with the color a little bit. Totally fine. Yes, but it's brighter on the tops. Pretty, pretty, pretty. White tops. Good job. Okay, now I'm going to get the white on my finger. And I'm going to make a moon. Everybody ready? Everybody pause and look up. Julia, watch. I'm going to go, oh, because I need to make a circle. And because I'm human, I can't make a circle. But I can make a rainbow and a smile. Let's see how I did. Nope. It's an egg. I mean, it has to be. I have to make it rounder. I didn't go smile like a U. There, that's better. And then once I have my moon, now I can now I can just make a circle. But remember, you can't make a circle. Very good, right? So it, and it's about three fingers big. I just go like that. Smooth it in. Fill in your moon. And then get a tiny, tiny piece of purple. Oh, that's, I think that's too much. Look at how much I got. No, get that off. Just a tiny bit of purple and put it in her tummy. And why do we use our finger? She's completely smooth. Our finger's smooth, so then the texture of our moon will be smooth. So we use our finger, so it's smooth. Good job. Just use your finger on your moon. Just use your finger. Just get a tiny speck of color and just rub it in. Tiny bit, now rub it in. Okay, now we're gonna do our water. Now swirl it in and make baby purple. There you go. Okay, now we're gonna get our, um, do our water. So we're gonna find our, this little paintbrush. Oh no. We could use this big paintbrush and it's all dirty, but we don't care because none of these colors can hurt our watercolor. Okay, so we're gonna use this big paintbrush again. Can you find it? 
But I would like it to have a straight top. It's called your horizon line. Like this. Right? So I'm going to hold my paintbrush the flat, skinny way like this. And just try to draw a straight line. And you won't get it the first time. You'll have to go back over it. But find your super dark blue paint. There's a whole bunch of it. Super dark blue. Find your dark, darkest blue. Can you find this paint? And open it. And I'm just going to give it a poke. There. And it will not make a straight, nice line at first. It'll make an ugly line. But we're going to go back over it two times. But hold it the flat way. Like this. And we're going to push our blue. And as soon as you run out, you get more blue. But we go on top of that water, of that sky a little bit. So look how I'm tilting my paintbrush so I can keep an eye on it. But I go smash and I push by pencil. Oh my gosh, I ran out of blue paint already. And look, it's all ratty. We're going to do it two times. Don't worry. So I go, oh, that's terrible. So I get a little poke, more blue poke. Okay. <gasps> okay, that was a lot. And I just got, I'm using the biggest paintbrush. Look, look, look at me, Annalyn. Annalyn. The flat, skinny way, so it will make a nice, look at how flat mine is. And I just go straight and push, no scribbling, pushing my paintbrush only, pushing, 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 fell off. Now you do it. Push, no scribbling, that'll make it all furry. So you just push, and we'll do it twice, we'll smooth it. Push, and as soon as you run out of paint, more paint. Push, and then get more paint. There you go, more paint. Great, then let's get more blue paint and paint the whole below it blue. So we just stab our dark blue paint and go. Good job, and when do it one more time but with more paint and watch it get smoother. Yeah, that paintbrush will work for a straight line too. Make a nice straight line. No, you're scribbling, Annalyn. Watch, Annalyn. Annalyn, look. This paintbrush, push, push. Push. The pushing makes it straight. Yes. Look how much smoother. Yes. You can go up a little higher and try to smooth it higher up. Go a little higher and smooth it one row higher. Yes. Smooth, straight, and pushing. Nice. Okay. Now I can go and paint the rest of it blue. More paint. Big paintbrush, painted it all blue. Now switch to big paintbrush, Annalyn. Big paintbrush, smash, and then push, pull, push, pull. Nobody cares. Okay, all done. Get it all blue, 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 blue. And more paint. Tell the paint to do the work. If you're pushing really hard, you just need more paint. Get more paint. Get more paint, Annalyn. Get more paint on your paintbrush. It's pushing peanut butter. Now, when it's now, go where it's white and put it there. Yes, yeah, see how much smoother it is when there's more paint? Good job. Okay, now we get to decorate that. Look at mine. Um, do I have more than just blue? Keep going, Annalyn, all the way to the bottom till the whole thing's blue. And I'm going to add... <gasps> How many colors? Green, baby blue, white. So pretty. Keep going, Annalyn. Push, pull, push, pull. All, and what if you get the cardboard easel wet? Nobody cares. You just get it wet. Uh -huh.
The more paint, the smoother. Good job. Okay, everybody pause and look up. Now let's smooth it. Okay, everybody look at me. Look at the camera. We're gonna smooth it. So I'm gonna use the off, I'm gonna go really, no, I'm not gonna touch the top, cause I like the top, but I'm just gonna go off the page, smooth it. And then go a row beneath that and smooth it. And then, and I'm doing it slow and smooth, slow and smooth, and I don't scribble, I'm smoothing. Oh, that's nice, smooth water. Okay, Annalyn, the smoothing is very important. Do the smoothing. Smooth off the page. Smooth off the page. Annalyn, make sure you know how to do the smoothing. Her sister's helping her. I know. Smooth it. Good job. Okay, now let's add colors. Get your big paintbrush. I mean your uh, fluffing paintbrush. And we're going to drop off globs of color. So what colors do we need? We need baby blue. We need dark green. This will make turquoise. So pretty. And then I also need some white. You want to see? Look at my painting. Oh, do you see the green in it? And it made turquoise. Do you see the baby blue in it? Do you see the white in it? Nice. But let's just drop off long, skinny strings of color right first. So let's get um, let's get our super dark green. Where is she? She's only good for making this turquoise color. You see her? Now I'm gonna get a scoop with a little round paintbrush, the fluffy paintbrush, and just scoop it. Oh, look how much I got. I don't even care. And I'm gonna drop it off in long skinny strings. I start near the top. Wee! Look where I put it. Wee! Big glob of green. Okay, now I'm going to go another row lower and get another scoop of green and go, wee, oh. I put another piece of green. Big, long, thick, thick green. Because who's darker, dark blue or green? Dark blue is darker, so we got to put nice, thick green or the, the blue will just eat it. And it'll just be blue. It'll be very boring. Now I get another big scoop of green. Scoop. Oh, look how much I got. Now I go a little bit lower. Oh, look how much I put. It's a lump. Oh, but don't rub it in. You just drop it off a big glob of green. Don't rub it in because blue will eat your green. Okay, now, now is there any green left in your cup? Maybe get another scoop. Oh, and maybe go there, 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 there. No more green left in your cup because we put it in our water. Okay, now I'm going to get my baby blue and go, okay, wherever there's not any green, I guess I'll put some baby blue. Um, there. There, 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 there. Scoop. Blobby, blobby, blob. Uh oh. Blob. No, oh, the bottom's jealous. Blob. Okay. Big scoops of, of baby blue now. Blob, blob, blob. Nice and thick. Don't rub them in. Just drop it off. Big, big thick until there's no more baby blue left in your cup. Big scoops. Then I clean my paintbrush. I just get a paper towel and squeeze out the extra blue. Is there any baby blue left in your cup? Then put more on there. Scoop it and put it on there like a big blob. Like you don't even care. Blob. 
Okay, and then clean your paintbrush. Because you know what it needs now? What does mine have that yours doesn't have? Pretty white shimmer shines. So I'm going to get some white, a scoop of white, and go, all right, maybe there and there and there and there and there and there. Pretty. Okay, and then uh, and then we put white too. But you have to clean your paintbrush to put white. How come? Because uh, that blue is a little dark. You have to squeeze the paint out. Remember when I showed you like this, Annalyn? Look, this is how you clean a paintbrush. You put it inside the paper towel, pinch it, and squeeze the paint out there. Now it's mostly clean and you can get some white. There you go. It's a squeezy thing. Yeah. Now that's clean enough to get some white. You won't drop any white off inside your, or blue off inside your white. Now everybody pause. Even if you're busy, everybody pause and look at me. Now, Annalyn, you still have to put white, but I need you to watch me. Okay, watch me do this. Don't do anything, Annalyn. Watch me. Okay, watch. I'm going to smooth it. Remember smoothing? But watch. Don't do it, Annalyn. Don't do the white yet. Wait for me. Watch me do this. So I go off the page. To off the page. Did I scribble it in? No. I stretched it. And I give it permission to do whatever it wants. And then I go back the other way. One row at a time. And that's all. And then, look at, I didn't get anything at the top, so maybe I'll do the skinny little paintbrush and just go near the top. And then, if it wants to be dark, look at that dark spot. I don't care. If she puts nice and straight, because it's calm water. And why can't I go like this, like I did the sky? What happens when we went like this? It makes one color. So, we're after we drop off our colors, we're nice and smooth and straight and flat. Good job. Annalyn, okay, good job with the white. Maybe a few more spots. Maybe a put, Annalyn, put some white up high, down low. So we're just going to streak them. Maybe a little piece up high of white. Up near the top of the water. Up here, yeah. Okay, now get your big paintbrush. Don't rub it in. Don't rub it in, Annalyn. Okay, get your big paintbrush. And do you remember smoothing? Start off the page, all the way across, straight. Then the next one underneath that, all the way across, straight. And just let it have little pretty colors. String the colors along. String the colors along. Nice, nice and straight. It looks like calm, pretty water. And we don't scrub them together or they'll just turn, turn baby blue. Do you have stripes of color, like water? So pretty, nice. And then we don't do it again. Don't keep doing it, Annalyn, because it will just turn baby blue. So we just like it how it is. If we keep rubbing it, baby blue, right? So we're done. Okay, who wants to know how to make a palm tree? So this is how we make a palm tree, okay? So you guys ready? Everybody watch me. Okay, so I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna switch back to this time, this little blue paintbrush. 
She's like a miniature version of this one, right? She's square. But she has purple on it. Oh, my 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 black um my um palm trees are black because they're a silhouette. Okay, so I'm gonna clean my paintbrush. I can move all these paints out of my way. Get out of here, paints! You're in my way. All I need is black. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, all you paintbrushes. Okay. There, I put the lids on them. But I need to clean this purple off, and I just give it a little pinch. Bye. Pinch. Oh, I broke my paintbrush. Uh-oh. I better put it back on. There. Okay. I fixed it. Okay, you ready? Yep. And you cleaned it, cleaned it off. Get a little paper towel and clean that off because now we're going to use Blick. So, Andrea, remember when we did when we did um, this big paintbrush and we could hold it? I'm holding the little paintbrush, but I could hold it this way, right? Or I could hold it the big way, both ways. Right? Well, I'm going to hold it the flat way and try to make a long skinny line. But I'm going to get Blick and I'm going to make a little tiny baby one over here and practice. Remember when we made our baby? Oops, I just touched my mouth with paint. But remember we made that first cloud? Made an ugly baby one. We'll make an ugly baby um, palm tree over here. Right? But then we'll make a big one because we'll know how. Okay? So I get my black paint. And all we have to do is, as soon as we can make one of these, we can make all of them. Okay? So as soon as we make a good one, our brain goes, oh, okay. But palm trees are weird. They have no branches. They have just leaves like a flower. And they're all attached to the middle, to the trunk of the tree. Weirdest plant ever. So... All we have to, and they're like shaped, they bend a little bit because of, you know, gravity. So they're not straight. They bend a, li a little, like they're tired. Okay. So um, it's about a hand away from, a hand away from the side because I don't want it to touch the side. So, hmm, and I'll just put a little black dot in my yellow to tell me where it's going to live at. Look what I did already. I already put a little boogie there but I stab my black paint with my little blue paintbrush and it's about a hand away from the side right in the middle of the yellow poke right and so where, where did I put that so it's about a hand away from the side because I don't want to touch the side of the painting and it's about a hand from the water ish it's not like real. It's not real. I've never been to this place. Right? I don't know. Okay, now we're going to make a palm frond. Did you put that dot, Annalyn, with black? Did you put that little dot? Look where it is, Annalyn. It's a hand away from the side and a hand from the bottom. Okay, and now I'm going to get black. Watch me, Andrea. Everybody watch. Okay, so I got black paint. I get a lot, so I have far to go. And I'm gonna hold it to flat, skinny way, like this. Is it, can you see it? Flat, flat, flat. Not the big way, that'll make a huge line. So skinny. And I just, I just jump out and make a little rainbow. Uh, no, not a rainbow. Uh, a straight line with a curve in it. No, I just go, wee, like that. Just go, wee, I don't know. Oh, that's terrible. Let me try again. Wee, okay. I don't know. Now you do it. It's still a little, a little bended line. Right? And, and then, and then all of it, you see how big you made this one? All the rest of them for this tree will be the same size. They'll be, they'll all be this big, this big, this big, this big, they'll, they'll always be the same size. Yeah. Okay. Now watch. Now I'm going to turn my paintbrush the skinny way. Look at me. 
the skinny way like this. Andrea, look. I can't see. Okay, so I hold it the skinny way and I'm going to make little number ones. It's just like the big square paintbrush, but I just go one, one, one. Okay, so get black paint. Stab! I got a glob of black paint. And I hold my paintbrush the straight up and down way. Watch me. I just place some ones. Uh, one, one, one. Oh, that's not very long. One, 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 one. Okay, now you do it. They're straight up and down, so they're skinny. Well, that looks like a comb. Does that look like a palm frond? No, because how about if we put a whole bunch of little flickies, little number ones in between those? So watch me, everybody watch. I just go one, 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 one. There, it's more floofy. One, 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 one. Now you do it. Because now they're kind of touching. More like a palm tree. One, 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 one. Right? I went one, 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 one. Added more. Right? So do you know what this means? You know how to make palm trees. Now all we have to do is decide where all the leaves go. That's a palm frond. Hey, Annalyn, can you turn your painting so I can see yours? Can I, all I see, I, I don't see, I see, I don't see yours. Yours is turned like that. Can I turn your, turn your painting so I can see it? Turn it. I can't see yours. Whoop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Turn it more so I can see it. Keep going. Turn, turn so I can see it. All I see is the dot. Keep going. Okay, Annalyn, look. We went like this. We went, whee. I made a line and then we went one 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 make a wee want to see it up close watch we went wee and then we went one 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 oh I see it now okay it needs to be longer and come to a tiny 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 hey it comes to a tiny point like my clouds did tiny on the end mm -hmm. okay let's make another one okay black paint okay so maybe this one is more tired she points at the water she's sleepy but aren't all the palm fronds connected in the middle yeah so they're touching. So now I go, I touch the very, very middle where they're all connected and I go, wee, look at the water. Andrea, Andrea, wee, look at the water. And then what does that need? After that, now I go one, 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 and they point straight down because of gravity. You want to tilt them, don't tilt them. They go straight down. One, 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 one. Oh, it's just like we did the other one. <sighs> now go one, 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 one. Don't tilt them. Some people like to tilt them so that no, they just point straight down gravity. Oh, who wants to make another one? We made two. How do they look? This proves you know how to. Oh, okay. Annalyn, put the ones like this. Go <gasps> one, 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 one. And hold your paintbrush straight up and down like this. The skinny way, like this. Skinny up and down. Skinny. Uh huh. Hold your paintbrush the skinny way. Okay, now let's do another one. Other side. Maybe, maybe they're bending like this over there. Oh, excellent, Andre, uh, excellent, see? That is proof, you know how. Watch this. Now, maybe this one, she sticks up in the sky a little more, right? So I go, but she's gonna point the other way. So I touch the middle and I jump straight up and then I bend. You wanna see me do it? Watch, so I touch the middle and I go straight up, but turn. Oh, that's too big. Oh, don't do it big like me. No, that was too big. It's little. It's a baby one. I messed up. 
Okay, then I give it ones. One, 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 one. And look at she's taller. She's like this. You could do that. They just stick up and then they turn they bend a little. Now how about another one that gets tired and points at the water? Maybe I just go, I touch the middle and go, wee! Alright. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's droopy. She's droopy. Another one on Annalyn. And then what do I do? One, 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 one. Bye. Bye. And then, and then maybe a super tiny baby sleepy one. Watch this. Oh, good job. Nice, Jan 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 Janae. Good job. Okay, now I'm going to make a really sleepy one. I touch the middle and I go, oh, super sheepy. And then I give her onesies. All right. Now I have five of them, and you only have four, because you're jealous of me. But they're all attached to the middle, because that's what palm trees do. Mm -hmm. Now she needs, that's a BB, a BB one, right? And she, need, she needs to be connect. We don't know where her, her land is over here somewhere. We, we don't know. She's a, somewhere over here. But look at mine. All I did was go like this. I touched, I touched it, and I just went, Whoa. fall off the page. That's a trunk. Whoa. All right. But it's t it touches the middle of the tree, right, because that's how palm trees are. And I stab my black because I have far to go. And then I just go, all right. But now I can do it the big fat way. And I just go, I fall down. Watch me. Everybody pause and look up. I just touch it and go, wee until I fall off the page. Now she's attached, and her land must be over here, not in the picture, right? We don't know. Who wants to make another palm tree? Look at this one. Oh, my God. So that was our practice one. So it's our ugliest one. Now we get to make a what? One that's right underneath the moon? And look at my palm leaves go in the water. Sometimes they go as high as the clouds. I don't care. I don't care. I could put them where I want. Okay. Now, okay. So I'm gonna get black paint. I just want to put the dot where the middle of the tree is. So she's like a. She's like, oh, there's my moon. So where does she live at? In the middle of the yellow, right there. Right. So I just go, okay, uh, moon, blop. And that's where my middle of my tree is going to be. It's right underneath my moon. Bloop. Right in my yellow. Put a palm tree. Right underneath my moon. Here's my moon. And I went right underneath it. Okay. Now how do we make a palm tree? Can this one be bigger? That one was my baby one. It was just born. Now I'm going to make the mommy one. Okay, so watch me. Okay, remember how we did this first one? Let's just do that one again because we trust ourselves. You ready, Andrea? Watch, here I go. I hold the skinny way. Watch, watch me. Stop painting yourself, Andrea. Andrea, look. Okay, so I'm gonna go, I land and I go, wee! She's way bigger. Because she's the mommy one. Now you do it. Wee! Yes. And then what? And then what does she need? She needs little number ones. One 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 one
and I go one, 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 one. Very nice, you're beating me. Wait for me, Speedy Gonzalez. Okay, now I'm gonna make another one. Okay, maybe she jumps out the other way and I just go, wee, like a bird. But she's not, she's a palm tree. And then one, 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 one. We already know how. All we have to do is make ones. One, 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 one. We have proof. We know how. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Hey, Annalyn, yours could be way bigger. This one's the mommy. Make your branches bigger and longer. She's the mommy tree. Okay, now watch. Oh, oh, okay. So I need some more sleepy ones. So I touch the middle and I go, whoa. Okay, she looks at the water. She's like that. And then what do I do? One, 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 one. Oh, what if I touch the water with that one? Don't care. Yes, one, one. And then give her palm fronds. One, 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 one. Their little leafy things hang down. One, 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 one. Well, the other side is jealous. Let's jump out and do the other side. Hello. And then one, 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 one. Oh, I'm making J's. Why am I doing that? I'm not being straight up and down. What? I feel like mine was ugly, so I put one up sticking straight up. Okay, now maybe a sleepy baby one. Sleepy one. I'm so tired. And touch the water. And then I go one, 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 one. Maybe another one. One, 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 one. Oh. Look how many you made. Look how good you are at them. Look at that. What? Okay, now I need the trunk. She's floating in the middle of the air. We have to attach her to our painting. So how did we do that last one? We did, wait, wait, don't do it yet. Let's try to get to this corner. Let me show you. Watch me, I'm gonna get lots of paint because I have far to go. Lots, 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 lots. I got a huge glob. Okay, now I'm gonna try to attach her to the corner of this painting. Watch me, Andrea. Watch, I'm gonna go, I touch it, but I'm trying to get to this corner. What if it bends? I see in palm trees bend, but I just go, wee there. Uh oh, I ran out of paint at the end. I'm just gonna get a little extra more paint and make it thicker. <gasps> there they are. Who wants to do one on the other side? You could put, you already have a dot for it, Annalyn, right there. You could put a baby one on this side. Look, Annalyn, you, you see your little dot over there? You could put one over here on your painting. You have a dot right there, you could just make it a palm tree. On the other side of your yellow. Can you point at that dot for me? Okay. Who's all done? Who thinks theirs came out good? Nice. Let me see. Look at how much different your clouds are now that they're dry. <gasps> what? Look at them. Look at your different colors in your sky, your clouds, your different watercolors. Fancy schmancy. So good. Who else is going to show theirs off? <gasps> Andrea, are you going to show yours off? I want to see, I want to see, I want to see. You made them. I didn't get to see them because it was off camera. Love it, love it, love it. 
amazing. I love your sky. I love your clouds. Your water has lots of color. <gasps> There's yours. Look at all the colors in your water and cut and you put stars. It must be nighttime. It's just getting morning time. I can tell. The sun's coming up. Look at yours, Anna Lynn. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Look at your delicate, delicate palm trees. They're delicate and tiny, just like you. Yay. Okay, and the paint on our hands, you have to soak them in water. Uh, like for 20 seconds, you have to get them all wet and then it'll turn to glue again. It has to soak up the water and then you can scratch it off with a scrubby. Okay. But not now. I mean, it's all dry on there. Okay. So who got to clean up our mess. It's not your mom's job, right? You have to put all your paints back in their lids and, and put them in your bag. If you want to keep your paint brushes, you can. You just have to wash them. Or you can throw them away. It just depends if you want to use them again. And dirty napkins, right? Good job, Janae. Look at your guys's. It came out so cute. Good job, everyone.